everybody, how you guys doing today? Julia actually hasn't been feeling good over the past couple days, so she set up an appointment early this morning to go over to urgent care. We're gonna head there now and just try and see what's going on with her. She has like a bunch of these white boils in the back of her throat, a ton of mucus. I've experienced a lot of mucus as well. Obviously, that could just be like allergies. Julia thinks it's a possibility that she could have strep throat. Yeah, I'm hoping it's just like a sore throat that's really bad, not strep. Yeah, hope for the best. Let's go find out what it is. So I've been waiting over an hour so far for Julia. I didn't realize it was gonna be this long, so I came to charge up my car for a bit. Yeah, I'm headed home. I ain't waiting here no more. I mean, she's only like 10 minutes away, so she just messaged me when she's done. Probably should have expected this though from urgent care. She was like, oh, there's only three people in front of me. <laughs> the nurse didn't even see her yet. And then you obviously gotta wait on the doctor. Hello. I literally almost cursed at the lady. Why, what happened? She gave me a COVID test in both nostrils and she kept going, all the way up. I was like, oh, oh you, like, I was like, oh my God, stop. <laughs> I was like, this is the worst COVID test I've ever gotten. She made sure she got all the way up. She's like, I'm sorry. I'm like, what the heck? You don't have strep throat. But it has to go out for another culture to see if it's bacterial. So you don't know 100% if you don't have strep yet. This, the first test came back negative, but okay. you never know in the second test, but it usually comes back negative. So no COVID? I find out in two days. Oh, it's one of them tests. Well, no, if they don't call me, I don't have it. Yeah. But they prescribed me prentazone. Didn't you take that? Prentazone? Doesn't that make you eat more? It's a steroid. Yeah, it's supposed to, but I don't think it made me. I was already like eating a lot. Though, so I don't know. That's true. <laughs> yeah, she's like great because we're just on this diet. <laughs> yeah, it's at the CVS right across the street if you don't mind. Oh, we're gonna go there right now? Yeah. yeah, that's cool. So my friend, I was just talking to him, his wife has the same symptoms that you have right now. So maybe it's just like a really? a thing going around. It's I think it's viral, that's what he said. Yeah, a lot but of people are getting it. What does a steroid do? You get really big. Like, no. <laughs> okay. Cody is on his way over here right now, and he actually just got a perm on his mullet. If you don't know what that is, basically it just makes your hair like really, really curly. So I'm gonna record my reaction when I first see him. Let's see it. Whoa, that's crazy. Isn't it? Let me show you guys. Wow. Dude, that's literally my hair if I don't brush it yeah, after I wash it. It's hella curly. So like over the next like 72 hours, once I start putting like Moroccan or argan oil in it like as a moisturizer, mm -hmm. and then once I wash it, the curls will stretch out a little yeah, bit. Yeah, they won't be as tight. Cause right now it's curly as yeah, my, my, my curls get so tight, I always brush through them. So it kind of just gives it this look. I don't know, I always feel weird about keeping it like that. Yeah. Cause that makes my hair look like I have no hair. Do you like it though? Yeah, yeah, it's good. I think I'll probably like it better once, once they stretch settles, out a yeah, bit. yeah. Oh, Oh my god, it's so curly. I know. You should have done it on top. I couldn't have done it on top, it was too short. Really? And now it's even shorter on top. You got top. caught, yeah. Oh. Mine's gonna be curly as hell too. It's still growing. It's um You got a long ways to I, go. I do got a while to you go. You probably got maybe like four or five months before it's probably before it's like mullety mullety. Yeah. Like mine. Babe, are you ever gonna get off your phone? I'm making money, babe. Making money? You've been playing games all day. Yeah, I'm making money playing games. What how? Come here, I'll show you. So there's this app on your phone you can download. It's called MPL, which is Mobile Premier League. They have a huge variety of games that you can play. There's over 10 games, including bingo, eight ball blast, baseball, bowling, solitaire, fruit chop, and many more. And you can play these games and earn real cash. I don't believe you, show me. All right, let's do it. We have the MPL app loaded up now. You can scroll through all the games right here. Right now, let's play a little bit of 8-Ball Blast. Get some pool in. We'll do the rookie special since I haven't played this just yet. It'll give you a tutorial on how to play at first. Wow, I already scratched. All right, we get the point. Let's continue the battle. Now we are finding a player. There's me. There's our power. Let's just blast it all the way. My score's at 180 so far. Go in, go in, go in. Hey, let's go. So yeah, that's what I've been doing this whole time. <laughs> and obviously, if you win in the game, you can actually earn real money in real life as well. Well, how much can you earn? You can earn up to $50,000 a day by competing and playing the games. What? Yeah, it's sick, right? MPL has quick and easy withdrawals via PayPal and bank transfer. And I wanna thank MPL for sponsoring today's video because they actually hooked me up with a sweet deal that I have for you guys. If you click the link down below at the very top of my description and download MPL using my link, you will actually get $5 just by signing up on the MPL app. And on top of that, this is the best part, I'm giving away iPhones to three lucky winners. All you have to do is when you sign up on MPL, get your referral 
referral code and comment your referral code on my newest Instagram post at Lance210. And I'll pick the three lucky winners and message you to get your details. I'll order brand new iPhones right off the Apple site and just put in your info. So go check it out if you wanna earn some cash. So I just installed a new update for my Tesla. And on the app on your phone, you can actually look at the live view of the cameras that are on the car. Not only that, you can actually speak through the car itself, which is really cool. So we're on the app right now. I hit view live cameras. There is the front of the car. I can hit the side of the car, the left side of the car. Er, uh, never mind, that's the back side. And there's my back side. Now I'm twerking. Yeah. <laughs> okay, the left side. <laughs> I got bad service right now, so it's not the best quality. <laughs> There's like terrible service in my apartment complex, but obviously if I'm connected to Wi-Fi, it'll be a lot clearer. And then I can either honk it. Oh, that's loud. Oh, that's real loud. You can also flash all the lights on the car or even speak through the car. Yo, what up? Yo, what up? Yo, get the fuck away from my car. <laughs> that's so weird. That's so weird. Yo, 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 yo. Yo, 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 yo. It also like deepens the voice. So nobody can tell whose voice it is. Pretty loud too. I got a couple funny ideas I can do with that. You guys know we love going on board rides and I always love getting new toys, whether it's an electric skateboard, an electric scooter, electric go-kart. Well, we have a new toy that just came in. This is actually an electric scooter that goes 62 miles an hour. Yes, you heard that correctly. It's insane. This thing costs about four grand. I haven't tried it out yet. It's still in the package right here. We're gonna open it up right now. But this thing looks insane. I'm so excited. Funny enough, the way I heard about this was I was at the gym one day and some kid came up to me and was like, yo man, I love watching your videos and then he started talking about this scooter I was like oh my gosh that's so sick I want to get one so I placed an order it took a while to get here I've been waiting for like two or three months at this point So. I think they're both fully charged, but you gotta check. Hey, you got me GoPro batteries, let's go. I need these because my GoPro hasn't been charged in forever. Obviously, when we have the scooter, we wanna be able to record ourselves. All right, hello. Dude, this box is so big. I wonder how big the actual scooter is. Pretty freaking big. User manual? Who needs those? Yeah, who needs that? So, oh, this is heavy. That's why the delivery dude was sweating. Yeah, he's sweating bringing this thing in. This thing's huge. What, what did he do? He carried it? He brought it like on a the thingy. Like a roller? Yeah. yeah. It comes with a bike lock? No, I bought this separately. Uh, we'll get a bike lock. Power cables. Styrofoam. Sweet. Love this. Wow. And it's I'm cracked already. Yeah, we need PTSD from when we put all your furniture together. It just has styrofoam everywhere. Yeah. Charging block. Two charging blocks? I'm so confused why there's two. Probably just gives you as one as a backup. Maybe you can charge it twice as fast. Yeah. Julia just vacuumed the apartment, so. Yeah. <laughs> oh That's my a shame. gosh. Why is it gold? Because that's the color I got, and then it's sick. Yeah, it looks insane. Yeah, it's like the best one they sell. Oh. Pretty heavy. Oh. This thing weighs a fuck. This is over 100 pounds, dude. Grab an end? Yeah. Holy fucking smokes. Like someone scoop. This thing's fucking heavy. That's a couple hundred pounds. All of our scooters and stuff, we don't have a garage, so we just keep them inside of our apartment. And I usually pick them up and like put them in an area so I don't get, you know, dirt and track mud and shit in. Yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna do that with this. He ain't picking this thing I'm up. I'm literally gonna have to roll this in. You know if the battery already comes charged or if you have to charge it up? I doubt it. I don't know how long it's supposed to charge for, but I, it's it's definitely well over four hours worth of charging. Yeah, it probably, it probably takes like 12 hours to charge. Probably, it. I assume like eight 12. Oh my gosh, this thing looks friggin' crazy. So we got it standing up fully right now. There's this little piece right here that you stick in and it keeps it from bending down. And now we gotta put the handlebar on. Or you can just ride it with no handlebars. True. I mean, this thing's already dangerous enough as it is. Might as well just ride it with no <laughs> handlebars. This thing better have ceramic brakes on it. It's gotta have good ass brakes. Wow, that thing's huge. What did I say about talking about my dick in front of my friends? She oh. definitely was not talking about <laughs> your cock. Oh my god. And she was like, wow, that's the smallest thing I've ever seen. Then she'd be talking about your cock. No, you should be talking about your cock. <laughs> Valid. <laughs> I've never been one to brag. <laughs> you're not a grower and you're not a shower. <laughs> I'm neither. So unfortunately, it looks like it got busted up a bit. Or maybe one of them tried driving and just crashed it and then decided to send it to me. One of the two, because it's, it's banged up here too. Look how big these headlights are. So I guess this is why I gave you two battery chargers, because there's actually two ports right here to charge the battery with. So I'm assuming it just charges it a lot faster. It has like a fast charge. Got the kickstand installed now. Well, since Lance put that on, it'll probably end up falling off pretty soon. <laughs> the whole thing just <laughs> Yeah, I mean, we know your track record with putting together furniture, so I couldn't imagine it'd be much different putting together a scooter. Nah, I'm definitely not riding this thing now. Yeah, well, considering this isn't even closed all the way and you put this together. It's tightened as tight as it'll go. The whole ha the handlebar is gonna fall off. 
Holy shit, those are bright. Yeah, that's what I was saying, dude. They're massive LED lights. The screen is now on. Got 54% battery. Let's go drive it. Those are the headlights. Whoa. Turn signals in the back and the front. Oh my God, that's, that's the horn. Yeah, that's loud. Move out the way. You can stop. <laughs> I look so stupid. I'm gonna put a GoPro on my head so you guys can see, obviously. But uh, look at this head strap. Man, man's grabbed the strap. He's ready to go. Oh, yeah. Dude, at least split it down the middle. <laughs> <laughs> look like your brain's fucking broken. I gotta get this put on. GoPro's ready to go. I got a K turn. I, dude, it's so heavy. Yeah, that's probably like 300 pounds at least. Now I gotta get one of these. We'll be the Tesla mullet scooter boys. Yeah, right. <laughs> we'll be cruising everywhere with these. Yeah, turn the light. Holy f yeah, all right, bro. That's my eardrum. Probably kickstart. I wanted to assume they just- No, you probably, yeah, you probably have to hop on it and push and start going. Yeah. On one right now, now it's on two, three, four, five. I love how it like lights up red. Yeah. It, it gets like darker red as it goes to let you know that it's more dangerous. All right, well, it's going. This is on its lowest setting. 13 miles an hour. Bro, I don't feel like it should be doing that. Watch what happens when I stop. It's because you're using the front brake. But see, it's, why is it clicking like that? All right, number two. 20 miles an hour. Zoom. Bro, skip all the other ones. Just go right to five. I think we need more like area. Want to like, take it out there somewhere? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Yeah, I got to walk. I'm going to hop on the back. <laughs> <laughs> no. Do you think I can hop on the back with you or no? It's probably going to be dangerous. You want to try? <laughs> what I'm nervous about is this, bro. Like that just feels so unnatural. I don't feel like it should be like that. I think what we have to do is, oh yeah, there's a screw. Oh wait, never mind. Uh, oh. oh. Yeah, watch yourself. I just loosened it. Oh, wait, hold on. And then we'll lock it. Push hold it all the up. way down. There you go. Now, see, now it's better, right? Yeah. Now it'll feel more safe. You're going to try and hop on. It's a kickstart, bro, so I don't know how we're going to do this. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh. Oh, my God. Oh, Dude. All right, all right, okay, this is, hold on. on. I can't, I can't, hold on. I'm going to get off. I can't, hold on. I can't stop. I can't stop. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, bad idea. I'll that, walk. There's not enough room for the two of us. I smashed my fucking ankle right on the kickstand. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> Holy sh! 26 miles an hour. I just slid when I was trying to brake. Cody's trying it out now. I put on level two, so it's not top speed, of course. It still goes pretty quick. Bro, this thing feels so dangerous. I, I know, I agree. And it's so high, y'all, bro. It's literally the size like, of me. Like, it's so heavy, and it feels, like, so hard to turn. Yeah. Like, I had to really, really slow down to, like, be able to turn. I would definitely get injured if I owned one of these. <laughs> you want to take it on the road? Yeah. At the top speed? Yeah. So we got Julia and Cody in the car. They're going to record me. We're going to go on the highway. We're going to race. Yeah. Tesla versus scooter. Yeah. I'm definitely going to Oh, not the highway. My bad. Just the road. <laughs> I, I said the highway. We'll do that next. Yeah, we'll do that later. <laughs> Get out of the way! <laughs> Ew! The fart! Yeah, you look a little nervous. Wanna race? Come on, pick up the pace. We're doing 46 right now. Oh my God, this is so fast. Oh my God, almost 50. 50 miles an hour. Holy shit. We're literally just cruising at like 47 miles an hour right now. That's Yo. insane. What? There's only 24. What? There's only 24% battery left. All right, we should probably turn around. That's why I can't hit top speed. All right, let's turn around. He looks, he looks so, funny, so funny. My eyes are tearing so much from the wind. Yeah, my pussy hurts too. Look, it shows on this screen. It shows that he's walking really fast, but if I get closer, I think it shows him on his scooter. Why is he but red it, it's too? Like, it's like warning me. He's flashing red because like the Tesla thinks I'm too close. Oh. 
So it keeps swapping back and forth between like showing him running and then showing him on a scooter. <laughs> so following behind Lance, not a good idea. I was about this far away from him. I'm pretty far, maybe about two or three car lengths. Obviously we're slowing down because we're gonna be doing a U-turn, I think. But my Tesla did the thing that it does with the automatic braking because it literally thought he was just a pedestrian standing in the middle of the road. So we established that the safer option is to just have Lance follow behind me so that way my car doesn't do that thing again that it does. My guy was absolutely cruising on this thing. It's insane. You look so scared. So we're at 50% battery right now. It's only allowing me to go up to 50 miles an hour, which is still really, really fast. Wait, aren't we at 25% battery? So it was at 25. As I was speeding, it was oh. 25. And then when I let off of it, it went back up to 50. Okay. So it's still got some juice, uh, but obviously at 100% battery, we're gonna be going over 62 miles an hour, which is Insane. Insane. Yeah, I mean, 50 was even fast. Bro, the amount of tears that were just flowing out of my eyes from all the wind. Yeah. <laughs> That's probably why people wear helmets with these with like the visors on them so that way their eyes don't get all teary. But we're going to adjust the handlebars real quick. Lance said that the throttle, just hanging too it was low. too low for him. He was having to, it was kind of hurting his thumb to push it in. I just took the GoPro off of my head and I got waves now. Look at this. Lance got the Delta Omicron on his forehead. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot of fun. I just got done riding. I have it charging up right now. I'm not too sure if I'm supposed to use both of the chargers that I came with, or maybe that's just an extra. There are two ports, of course, but I looked it up and it seems like even based off of the video that the company made themselves, they're just using the right right side port when charging it. So I'm just gonna do that just for safety reasons. I'll do some more research before, you know, I end up doing something to blow the battery up. <laughs> so I'm just reading the manual that I came with right now. And when I was riding it, the reason it wasn't reaching top speed was not because it only had 50% battery. It's because I was only riding in single motor mode. There is two motors. So I have to put it in dual motor mode and then I can reach the top speed. Some other cool features, I can actually set a password on it. So when somebody tries turning it on, it won't go unless they type the password in. There's also a cruise control mode. So basically just like a car, I can have it go a constant speed without even having to press the gas. It has been three days since you went over to urgent care. How are you feeling? You didn't get a call about COVID and you didn't get a call about strep throat. So you don't have those, which is good. Yeah, but my throat is like, feels scratchy again. Yeah? So the prednisone isn't helping? It was for like a day and then it's like coming back. But I still feel like a little bit worse than I was two days ago. Really? So it hasn't gotten better at all? No, I don't think so. Wow, that sucks. Well, at least you're eating now. Yeah. I'm which the prednisone starving. is probably helping you do that. Yeah, I'm you know? starving. You know, obviously you're taking steroids, you're gonna get big and strong, you need to eat. So it helps you eat. For the little kids that watch, that's not actually what prednisone is. It's not that type of steroid. Also, I'm not It's a naked. joke. Yeah. I have a shirt on. Damn. Shut up. Wait, Julia, I need to get my clickbait. <laughs> that is gonna do it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up button. And other than that, we'll see you guys next time. Peace.